so there was a dream once where I just remember seeing a couple from like the top corner of a hotel room and they were packing like it looked like they were just getting ready to go it was like a true romance scene just you know you could tell they, these were just I don't know a couple of misfits eloping and I don't know just it seemed very sweet but at the same time there was this kind of mystery of like what are they doing where are they going where are they coming from and I didn't know who they were like they were just these people and I just distinctly remember I guess looking at them like a camera it wasn't really I wasn't really there I was just seeing the event unfold and anyways I guess the scenery just changed where it was me and I ended up waking up I guess right next to some friends and family and everyone seemed kind of distressed and I was wondering like what's going on and so they were saying how they were being threatened by these people over the phone by through the television like just crazy shit and I ended up getting a phone call and I heard these people in a very familiar voice saying like you know if you don't tell us the truth we're going to come get you and whoa like I just remember changing into different people I guess and seeing different points of views being threatened I would look at the, I would actually be like looking at the TV and there'd be a news reporting a news reporter giving the report and all of a sudden it just changed into this person like I don't know, <laughs> threatening really or there was another moment where I just remember laying down and these two people had some barbed wire and they were wrapping it around my leg and I felt it it was very like damn like what the fuck and I mean just more crazy shit but just the idea that like nobody knew who these people were and so everybody's just like no we have to figure out who it is and eventually the whole scenery kind of morphed sh shapeshifted into a courtroom and everybody was going in they were gonna be on there was gonna be a trial to see that okay what can we do to find these people and I just remember being like, oh, I'm just kind of tired, like, I just, I don't know, I just ended up going to sleep again. And <laughs> it's just a trip, because then I ended up watching a movie in a dream. And I saw the two people from the beginning, like, they were just sitting there looking, just chilling, relaxing. And, but immediately I knew, like, that's them, like, that's, those are the people who were, you know, threatening everybody, and they were the ones who were escaping, like, in the beginning of the whole thing. And so I wake up, and I remember going up to the courtroom, everybody was leaving already, and I was like, hey, like, you know, I know who it is, and they're like, yeah, we do too, like, you know, we're gonna go after them, we're gonna find them. And they ended up driving to the motel, but by the time they got there, like, they were gone, and I don't know if I remember visually seeing the couple leave in a kind of after frame, I guess, but I just remember thinking, you know, they just kind of got away <laughs> with it, and it wasn't too scary, it wasn't that out there. But I really liked the idea of those multiple perceptions. Being able to, I guess, again, shapeshift the scenery or it shapeshifting itself. It wasn't really a lucid dream. I don't know, it was just, there's so many different aspects to a dream and what you can control, what you can't, what happens, what really you're in control of. There's just too much to go into it. Now, the other thing that really did interest me was the way everything just unfolded. The way the different time frames just kind of ha shifted and how it happened in a certain order and how I saw something in the movie, like in the dream, in the dream. And 
Oh, it's just a funny way that dreams can do that sometimes. You just... I don't know, you dream something, and later on it happens. It might be the smallest thing, like the smallest coincidence, or just the biggest, like, whoa, like, sense of deja vu, and whatever it is. And, I, I mean, more than anything, it was just fun. I feel like some dreams can be very, almost spiritual in a sense, like you get a lot of insight out of it. Some dreams are just completely horrendous, like nightmares, you're just terrified of your fucking mind. Others are just relaxing, others are just sensual, sexual, just psychologically heavy. There's so many, many, many beautiful things 